Welcome everybody. I'm back y'all with another video. So, hey girl, hey, hey bro, hey. So guys, this is a collective read as well. Um, this is, I'm using the Twin Flame Journey Oracle deck here. We're going to get some messages from your Twin Flame. Okay, so let's see. Especially if um, if you guys are in separation from your twin flame. So let's see what's going on. So I'm getting that someone here is numbing themselves. Someone here is numbing themselves. Um, they can't focus. And somebody's divine masculine. Yep, we got divine masculine. Um, yeah, they're going... They are going through a dark time. We got a dark night of the soul and fresh start. Okay, so they could be over drinking, over indulging in different things to numb themselves. Um, they may have some things going on with them that from that stem from their childhood. We got inner child here and crossroads. So, yeah, somebody's divine masculine is having a hard time right now dealing with things from their childhood, things that they suppress, um, and they numb themselves, okay? They numb themselves. I see as well, too, like, okay, they want a fresh start. They want a new beginning, okay? So I feel like this could be someone's masculine, um, Maybe you and them are separated from each other. Y'all are separated from each other. This person, um, we got mask and family here as well, too. This person wears a mask when they're around their family. Really what's going on is that this person is stuck. They feel stuck, okay? And they been isolating themselves from you from other people because they're they're really feeling stuck and like i said they're over here numbing themselves they're over here numbing themselves um they have some serious issues that need to be um may need some therapy may need someone to talk to i feel like uh, Divine Masculine does not have anyone that, that he feels that he could be vulnerable with or open up about these things to. They could also just be dealing with their, a child or children. They feel like they're at a crossroad. What else? I told you, dark night of the soul. This person has been this way since last summer. Yep, shadow work and bound. Oh my gosh. Like, yes. This person is really in a dark space, okay? This stemmed from their childhood. This is something about their childhood that they have not had therapy for, spoke to anybody about, haven't got over. This is why they're at a crossroad. But ever since last summer, this person has been real, real, coming off real dark, okay? Really dark. It's some things that they have not let go of because we got released and the answer is no. They too prideful. They too, too got too much pride to, um, to come forward and, and you know, resolve these issues. They may not even know how to. 
So they come off, they put their pride first, their ego first, to try to mask this, this darkness. separated um i see them watching you we got separation i'll tell you they're stuck they're stuck um they don't even know how to come towards you and communicate and speak up but they know they got free will but they are steady wearing this mask the mask is that they're putting on uh this big macho man energy when really they are like a child, okay? They're like, they're still this little child that still has these issues that they haven't resolved from their childhood. This is why they're in this stuck energy. So it looks like, yeah, okay, all right. I like this energy, okay. Okay, spirit says in divine timing, this person is going to, okay, in divine timing, it looks like, it looks like um, a fresh start is going to come towards this divine masculine, okay. Okay, somebody, this person is going to come to you with an offer, wanting to bring the family back together after a period of solitude, after a period of solitude, after a period of them having to go through an awakening, after a period of them uh, having to realize that they may have been playing a victim or they possibly may were a victim in a situation and something that happened to them as a child. This person is wanting to return and surrender and take action. I see them painting. It says spring here. Spring is when things, this is the new year. Okay, spring is the new year. Spring brings in a lot of new, fresh energy, fresh start, fresh new beginning. So a, another picture is being painted. This person is painting out a different picture of themselves. We got muse here and metamorphosis. This person is going through a metamorphosis, okay? Um, it's going to take some patience, especially if you have children with this, with this person. There is a lot of things that this person needs to purge from, okay? And they need to be more open to their spirit, guys, in order for them to have this first new beginning. And, and spirit says it's in divine timing. Okay, but this person is going to come towards you with the offer. But there are definitely some things that need to be worked on. And maybe they need to spend some time alone. Okay, maybe they have just been numbing too much. Maybe they've been coping using drugs too much. Maybe they've been coping using alcohol too much. Maybe they need to sit with themselves and think or go to the person who they feel like played a part in the situation. Find some way to give it some closure or some healing um, so they could have this new beginning because I do see them wanting to go through a metamorphosis. I do see them wanting to purge from this energy. I do see them wanting to take action um, and be a better person. But this person is definitely operating in their dark energy. Yes, look at this. Bound. And I I clarified the inner child. And this is bound. This is the devil card here. Okay. 
We got deception and twin flame. They have problems with compromising. I see that as well. Because we got grief and compromise. They don't like to compromise. They have a hard time compromising. And in the past, like looking over and reviewing, looking at things that they've had, they need to take a new direction, okay? Maybe they were abandoned as a child. They felt abandoned as a child because we got abandoned here. This could have happened in the past and with nostalgia. Maybe they were abandoned, could have been abandoned by a parent, a loved one. Um, they just felt alone, okay? They just need a divine feminine here. We got divine feminine who can recognize that. Recognize that they had, it looks like their childhood was real messed up. I'm going to be honest. It looks like they could have been a could have been a victim to being abandoned or mistreated. This is something that they have conflict with. And see, this is destruction. Okay, this caused a disruption. This caused a destruction in their lives. They grew up still feeling that same pain. And these are, this is a lesson. Okay, there's lessons to be learned in this situation. Dealing with this person. This person has a hard time um, knowing their self-worth. Okay. We got pause and self-worth. They don't know their self-worth. I'm seeing them getting high because we got numbing and ascending. I see them getting high all the time. Um, they're trying to understand why things are, why their life is so stuck and why they can't find a balance. Now they, they wear a mask for sure. For sure. For sure. I see them coming in asking for forgiveness. These are cycles. This is a cycle that this person constantly goes through. So this is cycle a cycle that needs to be broken. How is it going to be broken? I'm not saying it's up to you to break this cycle because you may not be able to. This is this is their energy. But this is um this person issues that stem from childhood. I want to clarify separation and I definitely want to clarify uh, inner child. I want to clarify these here, these up here, the ones that I pulled out from the beginning here. I want to go a little deeper into this. This energy is still clinging on to them. Um, from their childhood. Tell me about divine masculine. What's divine masculine's energy? Seven of Cups and Nine of Swords. They are confused, worrisome, and they have could have anxiety um, about their plans. Like, what's next? They're anxious for what's next. They don't know what's next. Um, I see somebody real confused. Tell me more. Okay, the Ace of Swords. Very confused. This this masculine is very confused. They may not be. They may not know all the details to the how something occurred or the truth, the full truth about something. Okay, could be issues from their past with their father. We got the Emperor here. Okay. 
I see them trying to do the right thing or their father tried to do the right thing, but I see them like being distant. Like I just see them being distant. Yeah, I kind of see this person as well, like, um, very flighty. Could be a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. They have a lot of regrets. Um... Something here they feel burdensome about it's, it's about their past. Ten of Wands and Six Cups. There's something very burdensome about their past. King of Swords. Someone could have been very uh, uh, strict. No nonsense. Um. Could have been kind of mean. <laughs> You know, like, when you're a child, you, you think that when people are straight, you know, sometimes they do go overboard. It comes off as just, like, mean. Um, they're confused. Confused about, you know, the truth about something. Now, let's talk about this inner child. Okay. This person felt really alone as a child. They felt left out, like they didn't fit in. Um, I'm getting maybe two children because we got two of pentacles and knight of swords. I'm getting like maybe they had a sibling, but still felt alone. Um, like they did not fit in. Um, maybe they were left alone a lot. Um, and I just, I'm just getting like feeling stuck. Like they don't like somebody, they felt like they weren't cared for properly. Okay, saying that that had a lot to do with it. Okay. Um, I see with the Six of Wands, the Three of Cups, the Ten of Pentacles, like I'm seeing like a lot of people, you know, a big family. Um, but it's just something about it that's just toxic. Maybe the family was toxic. Um, this person didn't have the confidence to speak up. I see them having problems with communication. Um, I keep getting King of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Um, yeah, I'm getting a I'm getting a father, a grandfather, somebody older. Some it's a man. It could have a lot to do with the man, okay, um, that was in their lives that was causing them some type of problems. Tell me my balance is here. Devil, again. Getting Capricorn energy. Big Capricorn energy. But this is slowing this person down tremendously. 
And they take their time to do things because they like to do things the right way. Um, or they're or they were getting in trouble. I keep hearing give it some time. Family was saying, give them, give it some time, give it some time, give it some time. But this person really got this devil energy. Like this, this child really had this on their back, was carrying this energy on their back. Um, and family may not have recognized that until this person got older and, and you know, you're starting to see the results of things and feelings and, you know, all of that going unspoken. They're not sure which route to take. They had a crossroad. Um, I see them feeling like they're taking a risk. They're thinking about taking some type of risk. They're really, really, really at a crossroad. I want to know what they, why are they at a crossroad? What are they at a crossroad about? They're thinking about taking some type of risk. If they do something, it's a risk. Yeah, two of pentacles and the queen of wands. I'm seeing an apology. So they're contemplating on whether or not if they should apologize. Six of Swords came out in reverse. All these cards are upright. Six of Swords came out in reverse. So it's something that they aren't over. They won't let something go. Four of Pentacles, they're still holding on to something. They, uh, they, this person has to let things go. They hold on to things for, for a long time. Dark night of the soul. For some, spell work could be involved. We got the magician, the star. The three of pentacles and the six of cups. And it's like they did something like something before. And for some, it's magic involved. The magician and the star. I'm seeing try not to do that. Okay. Or trying to end something. We got that emperor here again. A single dad, a single father. Um... Ooh. I'm hearing know how to do it too. They may know someone who is into the craft. Okay. I see them trying to make something right too, like trying to balance something out. Now, we got the separation card here. Okay, there was a separation because somebody lied and was being manipulative. Manipulative. There could have even been money involved. Maybe someone stole some money. I'm just putting that out here. 
somebody thinks that somebody took someone's money. Well, I'm getting somebody is upset here. So there was a separation due. Yeah, lots of pentacles. Lots of pentacles. got financial issues because I see them having a hard time even taking care of them own selves um Hmm. Okay. I see this person. Um, they they have a hard time even keeping up with themselves. Um. Yeah, I see someone asking someone like regret asking someone for money. This person has a hard time even with themselves. Okay, I definitely see, see that. All right, so that's the message that I got, guys. Try to get as much information as I could. Um, I hope this was helpful. And y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below, all right? Until next time, I'm going to chat with you later. Ciao.